linear equations so here solving of linear equations in two variables so here we are going to discuss linear equations or simultaneous linear equations in two variables the two in an advanced level so here linear equation in two variable is of form ax plus by plus c equals to 0 whereas x and y are the variables in that particular equation linear equation whereas whose degree is of 1 x exponent will be of 1 and y exponent will be of 1 whereas a b c are the real numbers are the real constants whereas a and b are the coefficients of variables x and as well as y so now so let us discuss about or let us solve or let us know how to solve the linear equations of two variables in the advanced level. So, here an equation of the form that is a x plus b y plus c equals to 0 whereas a comma b comma c. So, these a b and c are real constants or in other words real constants are otherwise called as say here arbitrary say arbitrary constants these real constants or in other words arbitrary constants with x and as well as y. So, here these x and y are the variables x and y as variables and these x quotient is of a and y quotient is of b. So, this particularly a and b and a comma b both being non zeros. So, they should not be equals to zeros. So, here in the above linear equation. So, here what we have stated here that is a x plus b y plus c equals to 0 in the above linear equation since it is a linear equation because here variables are of x and y on whose degrees of 1 each that is why it is said to be called as a linear equation. So, linear equation in the above linear equation that is say a x plus b y plus c equals to 0 which we have stated here above. So, here in this particular linear equation so here this a so particularly this a is the coefficient of this x that is variable. So, this is nothing but the introductory part. So, this is the introduction of the linear equations of two variables. So, now so, we have discussed about a that is nothing but the coefficient of this variable x and similarly b. So, here b is the coefficient of another variable that is y. So, here we have discussed about even b also then now only the thing is that is c is left over then whereas c is a constant term then. So, here c c is a constant that is a constant term. So, here let us give an example under this. So, here examples of a linear equation of two variables that is x and as well as y. So, here 
so you have 1 that is first example is of 7x plus 3y minus 8 is equals to 0 and whereas second example is of 4x minus 7y is equals to 10. So, in which the variables are of. So, here variables in both the equations variables are of x and as well as y in both the conditions both the equations. So, x and as well as the y. Then now let us discuss about the system of linear equations. So, system of linear equations is nothing but a pair consisting two linear equations a pair of linear equations that two in two variables will be called as the system of linear equations. So, here in order to discuss about this system of linear equations a system consists of two that is pair of linear equations in two variables. So, here a pair of that is pair mean say in number that is 2. So, pair of linear equations in two variables is known as system of linear equations is known as system of linear equations. So, here for instance this pair of linear equations. So, here let us write the general form for instance like that is the general form. So, your gen form or the general form that is the general form of pair of linear equations will be stated in this manner 1 as 1 as a 1 x plus b 1 y plus c 1 is equals to 0. So, this is the first equation and the second equation is of a 2 x plus b 2 y plus c 2 is equals to 0 which is the second equation second linear equation because so here the x degrees of 1 and y degrees of 1 in the first case and similarly x degrees of 1 and y degrees of 1 in the second case that is the second equation put together these two will be called as the pair. So, here the pair of linear equations pair consisting two equations the two linear equations so here we can assume a 1 b 1 c 1 as different real constants and similarly a 2 b 2 c 2 can be assumed as different constants we will be getting a number of linear equations or two pair of linear equations. So, here a 1 b 1 c 1 are the real constants of the first equation first linear equation and a 2 b 2 c 2 are the real constants of the second linear equation whereas a 1 and a 2 are the coefficients of the variables that is x and b 1 and b 2 are the coefficients of the variables in two equations that is y and c 1 and c 2 are the constants. So, here these two equations are said to be called as the system of simultaneous equations also. So, here let us perform one example under this. So, here these two the above set I mean examples are the system of simultaneous equations. Now, here example that is let us consider two simultaneous equations those were 1 as x plus y minus 3 equals to 0 as the first equation. Then now second equation as x minus y minus 1 equals to 0 as our second linear equation. So, these two are put together will be called as the pair of simultaneous equations or system of simultaneous equations. So, here we are going to solve the these two linear equations in order to get the solution that is an ordered pair of x and as well as y consisting an ordered pair that is solution set consisting x value and as well as y value. 
to get that value to get those values of x and as well as y that is variables values so here let us consider the case number 1 so i am going to consider the case number 1 in order to find out the solution set of these two pair of linear equations or system of linear equations the first linear equation is of x plus y minus 3 equals to 0 this is the first linear equation and similarly as per given similarly x minus y minus 1 equals to 0 is the second linear equation which is given for us then now I am going to block the linear equations this is the first linear equation and whereas this is the second linear equation I have to find out the solution set for these two linear equations or in other words I have to find out the ordered pair consisting x and y values so here in the first case I am going to assume at x is equals to zero and y is equals to zero or in other words at ordered pair or in other words it can be written as ordered pair as zero comma zero so this is the x value first coordinate is x then the second coordinate is of y so x value we have to replace in these two equations in order to satisfy or not i say here x by means of zero and y by means of zero in case if this if this zero comma zero satisfies both the conditions then 0 comma 0 will be the solution set so here at 0 comma 0 so i am going to substitute in this so x as 0 and y as 0 x value is of 0 then now plus y value is of 0 then minus 3 equals to 0 so we can cancel 0 and 0 which have, which have no value so minus 3 is equals to 0 but minus 3 is not equal to 0 but here we got the condition as minus 3 equals to 0 the condition which we got is false similarly let us substitute here also that is in the second case so it must satisfy this ordered pair must satisfy both the conditions or both the linear equations x by means of 0 minus y by means of 0 minus 1 is equals to 0 so we can struck off these zeros then now minus 1 equals to 0 so but minus 1 and 0 are not equal therefore the condition is of false statement so in this manner since we got false and false so here ordered pair that is 0 comma 0 x and y values is not the solution set solution set since 0 comma 0 is not satisfying the both the equations then now let us go for the second case that is case number 2 in case number 2 let us write the equations once again the same x plus y minus 3 equals to 0 as the first equation then similarly x minus y minus 1 equals to 0 which is our second equation so first equation is blocked and the similar manner as the second equation is also blocked but here i am going to assume so at 1 comma 2 say here 1 comma 2 that is x as 1 and y as 2 so you have to substitute so your x as 1 in this and y as 2 in the particular equations so x must be replaced by means of 1 plus y by means of 2 minus 3 equals to 0 so 1 plus 2 is of 3 minus 3 equals to 0 so plus 1 plus 2 by adding up plus of plus is plus 2 plus 1 is of 3 with positive sign and minus 3 kept as it is equals to 0 but minus 3 plus 3 gets cancelled 0 is equals to 0 the condition in here in the first case it is true whereas in the second case when x and y values are substituted as 1 and 2 so x by means of 1 minus y by means of 2 then minus 1 equals to 0 so here the sign of 1 is of positive so minus 1 and plus 1 and gets cancelled we got minus 2 but equals to 0 here minus 2 and 0 are not equal therefore the condition is false in this case but one is true the other is false both must be true then only it will be the solution set but one is false therefore so here therefore solution set that is 1 comma 2 is not the solution set then let us go for another one that is example that is case number 3 